Hi guys, Mr. Fury here. <sighs> so, a lot of you people are asking me so many questions about like, when's the next tank review coming out? When is you going to do that? When are you going to go back to it? It's been a while. There's so many tanks come out now and we want to see if it's worth it since you like doing it and helping us. Um, hmm. Obviously, I said last year that I was going to take back on it a little bit, like, relieve it a little bit, because there was so many tanks, and I've already explained this in another video, saying, like, 15 days, I can't easily do a video on it unless, with editing and stuff, but I already said that in the past video. You want to know the update now. So, I am working on a video. I'm working on the, um, the Calliope for World Tanks. I'm doing like a very interesting thing with it. I even got a Lego tank over there. As you can see on the wall above me right here, that's the Calliope box that it's been built. And I want to use that in the review because there's a lot to talk about the Calliope. I mean, we'll get to it, but trust me, I want to save that for the video that comes out. Also, people ask me about my stock motion animations of the Fury's Room. I'm trying my best to do it, like I really am, but describe what's going on with me is a lot of personal problems. Um, I basically don't have much time to do a lot of YouTubes, and I don't know why it keeps glaring like I'm some sort of Jesus with lights. Hang on a minute. Does that fix it? Yeah, it fixes it a little bit. But um, basically, I'm having some personal problems. Not financially or anything like that no 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 that look around me do i look like i'm financially hurt no i'm frankly fine but the problem i have is my health um i've been um recently diagnosed with stage two depression which for those who don't know it's basically different level of depressions like First one is just feeling down. Second one, you lose energy and it's like close to very bad. And then the third one is the, well, watch this. So it's been affecting me a lot. What do I mean by that? Like when I try to do videos, animation, when my energy goes down, I don't feel like doing anything. And it's not because of laziness. I really want to do these projects. I want to make memorable videos. I want to do funny comedy. I want to make people laugh. Because I like seeing the world laugh of the hell that's going on today. And the problem is, there's work, there's other things. You already know that from the last video that I've done. Not the last one. That's the Azura Lane one, which took... God, when I made that video, it took way too long. And it's not because, like, you know, like, I was waiting for a friend and all that. No, it just took me a long time to do the animation part because, one, it's animation. You're taking pictures and you're making still animation, going inch by inch, taking pictures so it looks like an actual movement kind of way. So that's what took long. But, but also when I was diagnosed with it, I ran out of energy really quick. I felt like everything was taking out of me like a fucking soul grabber grabbing my will to go a lot of times as much as it kills me but i want to make good content because it's like i forgot that guy's name but he said like a good game can be if you take your time with it a bad game will be bad forever if you go really fast forgive me i don't know his name because he's actually one of the good ones and i'm trying to remember who his name is but that's gonna hurt my brain but that's not what i'm getting at but my point is is basically I want to take my time on it. Uh, so, that being said, am I doing okay? Am I fine? Yes, I'm fine. If anyone's curious, if not, it's fine too. I understand. It's not a big deal. But it does affect me doing videos. And without the will and motivation, without the, you know, this depression getting kicked right out the curve, out in the streets... It's very hard for me, and I want to keep going, but, like, I always have that mind saying, should I keep going? Should I 
keep making the videos. And I know a lot of my friends says no, because it ain't worth it. It ain't worth doing tanks. It ain't worth doing World Warships. But I like it when I actually save some people. I mean, what was it? The Churchill. Churchill Flamethrower. I saved one guy. And that was worth doing that video. If, if you want to know, I'll, if I remember it, I'll put it down in the description down below. And I was like, okay. It's like, I saved one guy. At least that video was worth it. The Nemesis, we're going further back. People liked me doing a review on them, and they liked my content on that. And it blew up pretty damn good. I mean, that's what I mean. I, A lot of my friends want me to stop, but at least... I'm kind of happy to save at least one. At least one to show them that it's good or bad. That's my motivation all throughout my nearly almost nine years of doing tanks and a lot of years doing YouTube. And if you see me editing a lot of that's the fault again. Um, but the thing is, though, I just... I need to get this out of the way. I need to get it out of my system. I know there's like psychiatry, I know there's meds, but I really don't want to start taking meds because they make you more tired. I don't want that. I need these works done. I don't want to be a slug. I want to keep going, but it just, it kicks you right in the ass, doesn't it? Ugh. So, that's what I wanted to say in the update. I really want to like let you guys know I'm not gone. I'm not trying to be lazy doing these videos. I'm trying to actually put content in these videos. Like, every time I watch World Tanks videos I've done in the past, or see, like, the comments and stuff like that, I notice a pattern I always do. I talk about the tank, its armaments, show you a little bit of it, and then things. There's, like, no comedy that I want to try. There's no acting. There's no um, animation that I wanted to try. I know I don't want to go above and beyond. I don't want it to be, like, you know high budget Michael Bay shit. I want like you know, a decent way to entertain people. You know, learn and enjoy what I do. Learn to enjoy the vehicle you want to see, what boat you want to see. Or what game that you want me to review, because some people ask me that, of you want to see, but I wanted to add a little humor to it. Like make it a little bit funny and enjoyable. Like some viewers are doing nowadays like they're putting memes and stuff in there and i'm trying to do that recently sometimes too hell the azura lane video like again i was trying to do some more comedy in there to try to give you know some laughs and and did some animation it didn't get high enough views but hey i'm happy that i put the work in it to make myself proud when i see it down the road so that being said um I'm going to still work on the Goliath Beam that we feel. It should be out this month, hopefully, or the beginning of the next month. I want to try to get it out as much as possible, but I can't force myself. But I get it. I have to fight this depression. I'm just saying that's what I'm going through right now, trying to fight this illness. I'm also, since I didn't make a video yet on it, but I was also going to ask, I was going to do a video of people asking me questions. And me doing answers and stuff. I put this on Facebook. And now I'm talking right here to you guys. Like what questions you want to ask me. If they're good enough to put on YouTube. I mean. There's some that I had to. For good reasons. Um, but yeah. That's, that's what's happening to me. I'm just sorry that I'm not pushing out as fast videos as I can. I'm trying to take care of this problem I have and hopefully I'll get it straight now I go back to doing a lot of reviews Lego reviews I want to review that stupid god dang uh you know the artillery thing that was a long time ago I kept postponing that so I want to get back to it it's just just we need to fight this problem first okay so I appreciate it if you wait, guys. I love you all. And even if I'm not there doing a tank review, know this, that you have to judge it yourself on how much money you're putting into it. You have to judge it of what tier it is and what type of penetration, armaments, whatever, etc., etc. 
So, please, even if I'm not there, please just judge it by those three basics. That's all I got to say before I do more bank reviews or get back to a lot of it. So, that's my only advice I can give you. So, thank you so much for watching. And hopefully, I'll get the Calliope out video out soon and try to catch up. But obviously, I'm far, way far behind to catch up. But I want to at least be proud of my videos now instead of, you know, wasting so much time. All right. Thank you, guys. Avita's dead.